Hey YouTube, it's Dimitri, and today we're gonna do a quick book review. So today's book is My Life is a Quant by Emmanuel Derman. Um, I know this isn't like a technical book, and a lot of you have said, oh, I'd really love to see like more textbooks and technical books and learning and getting ahead. But I think if you wanna work in quantitative finance, this is hands down the best book to read on the sense of like a career, uh, learning life lessons. So I'm not gonna spoil it for you. It's essentially Emmanuel Derman's life. Um, story kind of how he got into quantitative finance and let me explain something simply it's not linear and that's how life is in general is that you don't say like oh I go I get the degree I get good grades I get the job I make a lot of money and life is great uh, there's a lot of life lessons in this book I think that people from different backgrounds can relate to um, again I don't want to ruin too much of the book but it, it's a really good read it teaches you a lot about uh, life lessons, career progression, uh, learning if you fit in a company, learning how to cope with being told you're stupid sometimes, uh, learning that mathematics is not reality for finance in a lot of ways. But he really like brings it all together and shows kind of his life stories. And for you, those of you that don't know, as many of you probably don't, Emmanuel Derman is essentially like the first quant, I would say, because Fisher Black uh, and Myron Scholes and Robert Merton somewhat created the, the Black Scholes model. And Fisher Black worked at Goldman Sachs and he hired Emmanuel Derman, who essentially was the first person trained by Fisher Black. So I would say more or less he's the first quant. Um, but he has a really deep background in analytics. The book, again, is just stunning. I would say it's five out of five stars. I know the last this review and the last review have both been five out of five stars. I will bring in some book reviews on books that are probably three or four stars, which aren't the best. But again, guys, I really do think you should read this. It's a really quick read. Um, it's more of a casual read. It's a life story. It talks a lot about physics, a lot about finance. Anyways, I encourage you guys to read this book. I know it's not super quantitative, but it does give you a lot of life lessons that you will not get everywhere else. Um, a lot of these are things I tell and I preach to you guys, and yet a lot of people just don't listen. Like They're convinced life is rosy. Uh, this book, I think, will be a great read for many of you, as you will see that being a quant is very challenging, and there's a lot of intricacies that make it difficult to become a quant. Uh, there's a lot of hurdles to get over. But in the end, I love this book. I think you guys should all read it. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below, hit the little bell for weekly updates, and as always, until next time. Thanks for watching my video. If you find it helpful, please like, share, and subscribe.